with you some challenging test questions on quadratic functions. I am Anil Kumar. Welcome to my YouTube channel and the website Global Math Institute. Here we have a very interesting question for you. It says, the line with slope of 1 is tangent to parabola y equals 2 minus 2x squared plus 5x plus 4. Find y-intercept of the line. Now this is a test question and I hope its solution will help you to prepare for test. In case you want to learn from me, feel free to send an email on the address given. Let us first understand what the question means and how do we solve it. A line with slope of 1 is tangent to this parabola. And we need to find the y-intercept of the line. So let this y-intercept be b, right? Well, let me take k, right? Let me say, let y-intercept be k. In that case, the equation line will be what? y equals to slope is 1, x plus k, right? So x plus k is tangent. Make sense? So k, the y-intercept, you can now find using the concept that if it is tangent, then the discriminant should be 0, right? So you also understand that if the equation is ax squared plus bx plus c equals to 0, then x is equals to minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a, right? So you have two solutions. However, the discriminant, which is, let me write just b square minus 4ac, right? Equals to 0 means tangent. One root. One place where it touches, correct? Tangential. So what we are going to do is equate the two, right? So as you understand now the concept, so to find the point of tangency, rather the value of k in this case, we'll say line x plus k should be equal to minus 2x square plus 5x plus 4. And we can solve Let's bring all the terms to the right hand side. So we get minus 2x square. It's good to bring them on the left hand side. I want to keep leading coefficient positive, right? So 2x square minus 5x. We have plus x plus k here. Minus 4 equals to 0. So in this equation, let's simplify further, combining 5x and x, right? So we get minus 4x plus c is k minus 4. Do you see that is the constant term, right? So you can see from here that the value of a is 2, right? b is minus 4 and c is k minus 4, right? So the discriminant which is b square minus 4 ac will be equated to 0, correct? Let's do it. So what we have here is b square which is uh, minus 4, right? So minus 4 square minus 4 times a is 2 and c is k minus 4. That should be equal to 0 for tangent. Is that clear to you? So, so we have 16 and this gives you me minus 8 k minus 4 equals to 0. So I have 16 equals to 8, k minus 4. Dividing by 8, I get k minus 4 value, which is 2, right? So 2 is k minus 4, correct? So from here, I can say k is 2 plus 4, which is 6. So k is my y-intercept, right? So we get y-intercept as equal to 6, correct? Do you see that? So that is how you can actually solve this particular question. Brilliant question. So I hope you understand the concept. Many times in test papers, you have such questions which are not really dealt in the classroom. 
So I hope these questions are helping you. Feel free to share your comments. If you like and subscribe to my videos, that'll be great. Thanks for your time and all the best.